The following is a conversation with His Divine Grace, A.C. Bhaktivedanta Swami Prabhupada, recorded on July 1st, 1974, in Melbourne, Australia. What Arjuna said? Arjuna Uvachan, Nashto Mohak Smitir Labdha, Tvat Prasadan Mayachuta, Stito Smi Gita Sandeha, Karishe Vachanam Tava. Arjuna said, My dear Krishna, O infallible one, my illusion is now gone. I have regained my memory by your mercy, and I am now firm and free from doubt, and am prepared to act according to your instructions. This is said. You are old student. Yeah. If you still cannot understand what is my instruction, then how can I help you? New students may say like that. Yeah. You are intelligent, educated, old student. We will say. Our movement is that beginning of spiritual life is to surrender. If there is no surrendering, there is no advance. This is the beginning. If that thing is lacking, there is no beginning. Or to speak of advancement. That is discussed already. Na siddhim sahabhavtati, na sukham na parādhati. It is the beginning of spiritual life. is called disciple. <coughs> disciple means to accept discipline. If there is no discipline, where is disciple? And disciplic succession, we have used this word. Now that dis- discipline is finished by one man. No, it will continue to go by succession. That is perfect. Evang param pra praptam evang raja sayogi. Sakali na yuga nashta paranta. Find out this one. As soon as the disciplic succession is missing, then everything is lost. Evam param param praptam evam rajar sayo vidhu sakali neha mahata yoga nashta parantam. Hmm. Nashta, this word is hmm. This supreme science was thus received through the chain of disciplic succession, and the saintly kings understood it in that way. But in course of time the succession was broken, and therefore the science as it is appears to be lost. That's it. As soon as the Discipline broken, then everything is lost. Now we can dance like a dog, that will not affect. Then nobody can do that. 
unless their spiritual strength Last night, Mother Dish Maharaj was singing, and so many you know, men became enthused to dance. So unless there is spiritual strength, it, it cannot be done. Others cannot ask and dance, no, that is not possible. That is not possible. Unless there is spiritual strength, you cannot enthuse others. So we should have to acquire spiritual strength by following the regulatory principle. Sanatan Goswami has that for forbidden. Abhishnava mukhadgi na pudu hari kathamitam sravana kathabbam. Those who are not following Vaishnava principles, one should not hear from him. Why? It is Krishna Katha, Krishna's Satpachishta Payoja. Milk is very good, but it, as soon as it touched by a serpent, it is no more good. It is harmful. So one must be Vaishnava. Unless one is Vaishnava, it is there is injunction, don't hear from him. It will be poisonous. So one who is not following Vaishnava principles, he cannot speak about Vaishnava. It is harmful. That is forbidden by Acharyas, Sanatana Goswami. Somebody says, what is the harm? He's chanting Hare Krishna. He cannot chant. There is a so bottled chant that is not effective. And even taking that anyone is chanting, let me hear. No, Sanatana Goswami said, no, don't hear. It will be harmful more than. In other words, if you are not following the Vaishnava principle, you don't chant, it will not be effective. Did you not uh, see the difference last night? There are many others. They could not join in the dancing. So far gathering men, if you do not gather intelligent men, yeah, what is the use of gathering men? Ekastanda stama hanti nachatara sahasar. If there is one moon, that is sufficient. What is the use of millions of stars? If one is perfect Vaishnava, that is sufficient. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's movement is that so means that in big instruction book it is not that whimsical. But still we recommend that go on chanting. This will help you when you want, when you want to go. 
It is exactly like that. If you ignite wood or fire, if the wood is dry, the fire takes place immediately. And if it is moist, then it takes time. Only smoke will come. A smoke is not required, the blazing fire. Then, if, if from the wood, if simply smoke comes, you cannot <laughs> take any work out of it. There is uh, um, traces of fire. As soon as there is smoke, there is fire. But it is not useful. It is useful for troubling your eyes only. What is smoke? Smoke means also fire. But you require blazing fire, not smoke fire. So blazing fire takes place if the wood is dry, immediately takes place. Otherwise you go on enjoying the smoke. Be satisfied. Well, there is smoke, there is fire. But it will not be useful. It will be useful after gradually the wood will dry. It takes a long time. Just try to understand this example. You require the flame, not the smoke. And if you are satisfied with the smoke, Oh, that is your business. If you simply be satisfied, the smoke is also fire. Unless there is fire, why is well, the smoke comes? That is a good argument. But smoke will not help you. It requires the uh, flame. That flame cannot be produced if the wood is wet. Wet means materially contaminated. Is that example or right? Yes. yes. Pure devotional service is flame. All other things are small. You must get the flame, otherwise your business will not be done. So naturally we fan when there is smoke. But as soon as plain comes, there is no smoke. So again, fan it, let the flame come, then everything will all right. Otherwise, be satisfied with the smoke. Your cooking is smoke. <laughs> For three hundred years. <laughs> <laughs> There is a very a human story that uh, one man, he has a yogi, so he approached. It is not story, it is fact. Uh, approached one big man. That, uh, people are very uh, inquisitive to see some yogic magic. So the rich man asked the yogi, what you have learned about yogi perfect? No, I can, in the severe winter season, I can dip myself in the water up to the day and practice yoga. So 
how long he can remain? At, at night? Yes. No, I can remain the whole night or as young as it. All right. If you remain within severe cold, within water overnight, then I shall give you such and such presentation. So he agreed and he did it. And in the morning, when the man came, he said, Oh, he is successful. Then he did not want, either he had no money or he did not want to give. So he had his one advisor. So I said, I do. No, no, sir, you cannot give money. Why? Then there was heat. How there was it? You know, in India they give Akash Pradeep mm-hmm. during Kartik month. They, this is our Vaishnava principle, I think. Uh, the lamp is there on the head of the roof. Mm-hmm. On the roof there is a bamboo, and uh, in the top of the bamboo there is light. So this man was in the lake and his advisor said, you have seen that the lamp was there and heat was coming. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> that lamp was three miles away and he still he advised, ah, yes, there was heat, therefore he could tolerate it. So what can we say? <laughs> his poor man. <laughs> And there was another uh, servant of that big man. So he had me to him that, see, I took so much trouble and he did not pay me. So don't worry, I shall see that you are paid. Hmm. What is that? Well, presentation. Yes. First of all, Okay. Then that servant, where well, this employer, there was an urgent business. The rich man said that tomorrow I am going, you must come and go with me. So, so suppose he has to go at ten o'clock. Then they, at nine o'clock, messenger can you, you are ready? No, just I'm cooking. When I said, I said, finish my cooking, take my meals and I shall go. So he was very urgently required. So why did you not? No, I'm cooking. Where are you cooking? Now, he has three bamboos and on the top there was a pot, rice pot, and he was giving fire here. So that rich man came and said, what kind of cooking this is? No, no, there is heat. It is going on. <laughs> How you do this? Such a nonsense. No, if the temperature from the lamp on the roof of the sky could uh, protect that man, why not it will be cooking? Uh, then he could understand this is the reply. So that man was paid. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> this kind of progress, cooking three miles above a pot, a little fire, it is not that. There must be proper adjustment of cooking, then you can cook food and eat. A little sm- smoke, a little fire, and three miles away the cooking pot, in this way cooking is useless at a One must be serious to cook. There is method how to cook. If you don't adopt that method and if you cook in your whimsical way, you will never be able to eat. If 
दुसरे आयसर को गेन माय वे आणि इफ यू अडॉप्ट दॅट प्रॉसेस विल इट हेल्प न सिद्धी जबाबा ते न सुखं न कोणा स्टार्ट ॲट दिस थिंग This this was knitted by a devotee who came from Sydney. Uh. A scarf for you to wear in the cold. Oh. That's nice. And I also brought one for me. <laughs> That's nice. And some mangoes. Ah, uh, that is from nice. Queensland. Very nice mangoes. Mm. They're very difficult to get. Mm. I like very much. Mango is the king of all fruit. Do you accept it or not? Yes. It is the king of fruit. Rose is the king of flowers. There is a statement in the Chaitanya Chaitanya. Two fruits. One fruit is a neem tree fruit. You have seen neem tree in not your country. Neem, neem tree you have seen in yeah. India. And their fruit. A little bitter. Yeah, yeah. very bitter. So the kakku They try to eat the mango fruit flower when it's small. And the crow, they eat the name chip fruit. So among the birds also uh, there is discrimination according to the quality. Kakku sings very nicely. He is fond of mango fruit. And the crow is fond of this neem tree fruit. The white swan, they live in a very nice garden. There is lake, flower. And the crow, they live in the city. Of course, here, In your country, the garbage is not open. Uh, in India there is thrown anywhere, and the crows, you have seen it? Yes. Yeah. They enjoy that. Therefore, a human being, if he does not come on the spiritual platform, he remains at him. That is different. Therefore, Bhagavad Gita will find the first beginning of teaching. Dehina Svin Jathadehi Kaumar Jyotanjara. Find out. As the embodied soul continually passes in this body from boyhood to youth to old age, the soul similarly passes into another body at death. The self-realized soul is not bewildered by such a change. This is the beginning of spiritual life. To distinguish between the soul and the body. One who does not understand that there is so, there is no spiritual education. Because he is animal. The animal does not know that there is so. A dog thinks I have this body. So this is the beginning of spiritual education. Therefore Krishna in his text, first this thing. Mm. 
everyone is acting on the conception of body as self. 